Alright, hi guys. This is a battle between Kenneth and Justin. I personally believe Justin will destroy my brother Kenneth, but we'll just have to see how the battle comes out. Trying to carefully consider their Pokemon, seeing as how these two have battled each other countless times, they know each other's strategies. Although my brother did add a new Togekiss to his team, so we'll see what happens, guys. The once peaceful air is now turning thick with tension at the appearance of such intense Pokémon. Which Pokémon is going to make the first move? Alright, so Togekiss uses Follow Me, and a not very original move on a Togekiss, but very effective. So Ambipom uses Fake Out, and it does a crit, which does hella damage. That's that Life Orb on Ambipom. Uh, excellently raised. And now a Bullet Punch. Togekiss almost died in one turn. That's very unexpected. Now we vow with the brick break on Ambi Palm. Ambi Palm goes down. Togekiss restored his health. is sent out. The red corner has already taken some serious All right, so one of my friends sends out Swampert. Let's see what he's going to do, guys. Weavile protects itself. All right, so Weavile uses Protect. And another bullet punch from Metagross. This should kill Tokikis. It couldn't take it. It's down. Weavile protected itself from the attack. Oh, he throws out his legendary Black Gengar I've had so many battles where I've lost to that, that abomination. But we'll see how my friend Justin handles it. Weavile tries to use Protect again, but it fails. And now Bullet Punch. You dead, sir! Oh, I am totally mistaken. My bad, guys. I would have thought that bullet punch would have killed it. Now here comes an energy ball from Black Gengar. It's a direct hit. That very safe Swampert. And now a waterfall, which will take Gengar down to one HP. Still have a chance to win this. Who's going to take the glory? The crowd is holding their breath in anticipation of the trainer's next move.
Blue Corner calls their Pokemon back. Oh, Gengar got called back. I didn't see that one coming. And so he switches to Garchomp. Swapper uses Protect, which means... Nothing at this point. I thought he was going to go for Explosion, but... As you can see, he uses Bullet Punch on Garchomp. We've all tried to finish off Swapper with the... And now we wait for the two to pick their moves. Weavile protects itself. Weavile protects itself. They're trying to prolong this battle for whatever reason. And he avoids Metagross' bullet punch. Good prediction on my brother's part. Now an earthquake from Garchomp. Earthquake tears open the ground. Metagross almost died. <laughs> But Citrus Berry hangs it down. Keeps it hanging in there. Excuse me, that was horrible. Gengar is sent out. Well, both corners still have a chance to win this. Who's going to take the Sends back out his Gengar. Weavile tries to protect again. That was my bad. I made an accident. Now Justin uses Metagross's bullet punch on Garchomp just to do a little tap of damage. And here's another earthquake, earthquake from Garchomp. I can tell that his guard shop is scarfed. It shouldn't be moving this fast. And then a critical hit on Metagross. A huge amount of damage. I can't expect. I, I didn't expect my brother to win. I, I thought he was totally horrible. Gengar uses an explosion, which does kill Garchomp, but unfortunately, I believe that was my friend's last Pokemon. But the attacker is down as well. The game is now over. The blue corner narrowly. Thanks, guys. This was a production by Pokemon Pokemania 313. Excuse me. Thanks. <laughs>